morning sunshine the days awake Please don't bite and I hope it's awake Morning sunshine the days awake See anything yet? Damn it, boy. I seen something. Don't you think I'd kill it? Where are you? <laughs> there she is. Where? Damn it, control yourself. You gonna spook her? Stupid ass. She gone? Nope. <laughs> oh, baby, you are 12 foot of love, ain't you? Here, hold this. Keep the light on her now. I got it. Loser. Yeah, you just make sure you hit it this time. Boy, I never miss. Get the boat on over there. Woo I'll have me a drink on that. She's a monster. <laughs> Come to mama. Well, yeah, let's go collect, man. That was beautiful, man. Man, you are quite a shot, man. She should be right here. Oh. Hey, hey, Buzz, it's not funny, man. Hey, where'd you go, man? Hey, man. Thanks, doctor. I feel much better. I'm not a doctor. I'm studying to, to be a doctor, but... Uh, you, you as well, right? Uh, no, not me. I'm not cut out for this stuff. I mean, the thought of cutting something open just... Ugh. Come on. You can do this. Give it a shot. Scalpel. <laughs> See the hair. Already the makings of a great doctor. Scalpel. Not too deep. Come straight back. Well, you, you can do it. I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just, <laughs> I can't. I mean, I know it's dead. But cutting into it just, 
just makes me want to puke. So that's, yeah, I completely understand. You do? Yeah, it's not, it's not for everyone. Thank you. I don't see why they don't have alternate projects for, for more sensitive students. Yeah. I agree. Unfortunately, they don't. So come on, let's do this. So gross. <sighs> I'm never going to pass this class. Sure you will. No. I'm going to fail. I, I can't do this. Dana. Listen. So these students and myself will go on my expedition to the Great Dismal Swamp. And uh, no, just to wildlife, that, that, that kind of stuff. So, uh, well, actually, <laughs> because once it was more of a camping trip, he said as an excuse. <laughs> but uh, the professor said that the students that go into a report, they get, they get extra credit. So we, we should come. We should come. I don't know. I mean, I'm not much of a woodsy person. Uh, it, it's, a, it's a swamp. Give you my number. If you if you change your mind, it's Saturday morning. We're leaving at seven o'clock. You still want to come? Just call me. Okay. What's up, baby? Come back. Good. Good. Oh, hey, Saturday night, Marshall Seven at party. He's been dying for us to come. Okay. All right? I don't have time for that. What? Ugh, I gotta go. Where? Oh, uh, uh, out. But I thought we could stay in tonight. Oh, well, you can. I just promised the boys I was gonna go out for a little bit. What is that? Uh, nothing. Is Kurt. He's my teaching assistant. Your teaching assistant? Why the hell is he giving you his number? The class is going on an extra credit field trip tomorrow. He told me to call him if I was going. Well, you're not. But I'm failing the class. I need the points. I don't care. Look, you're not going anywhere with this Muppet. Look, besides, we got the party tomorrow night. We promised Marshall we we're going to be there, okay? So look, let's just forget about Mr. Einstein here and have a good time. I need that. I am not flunking out of college because of your dumb look. jealousy. Look. How many times do I have to tell you? I mean, who buys you all your clothes and your purses and your designer glasses, your cute little candles, your, your jewelry? Oh, that's right. I do. And what more could you possibly want? I hate it when you do that. They make you taste like an ashtray. Look, I'm sorry. You know I don't mean to get like that, all right? I gotta go.
we close? Yeah, I'm gonna have to pee soon. I thought you went before we left. We did. We're, we're almost there, guys. Almost? I've been seeing swamp for miles. The swamp's over 100,000 acres, Jamal. I mean, if you guys want the true experience of the wildlife, then we're gonna have to come to the heart. Yeah, well, I'm fine with this swamp right here. Trust me, where we're going, where we're going is much better. Guys, I'm not getting any phone service. Hey, you got a signal? Oh, you guys aren't gonna get cell phone service out here. Oh, sweet it's... phone, Dana. That thing got GPS? I don't know, my boyfriend bought it for me. Can I see it? Sure. Isn't it a bit dangerous to not have some service? No, no, we'll be fine. I've got a full first aid kit, you know, snake bite treatment off the whole nine yards. Yeah, I've got a radio, so if we need to, to get in contact with the natural resource post, it's, it's not, it's really not a problem. I mean, if we do have an emergency, which is, which is unlikely, then we'll just radio them and they'll be here in a minute. Did he say snake bite? We can't go any further. There's the path. It stops. We got, we got to hike. It's just a little. This will be a time you guys never forget. Just a little further hike. You guys trust me. You need to pay me a lot more for this. Is this it? <laughs> almost. You said that the last time we were almost there. Guys, we just need to hike a, a little further, okay? And once we get there, you, it will be in the perfect spot. Kurt, there's not much of a path here, man. What happens if something happens to us? How do we get back to the car? Hey, we just need to radio the DNR. They got a fix on us, they got a track. What's the DNR? Farm and natural resources, Gary. Okay, but what happens if they don't answer the phone? Then what do we do? Mm -mm. Look, look. Look right up here. Between the trees, you see it? The tree? You see it? To the right, to the right. Right between the trees, the middle of it. Oh, yeah. What? It, 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 it's a hairy woodpecker. It's one of over 200 species of birds in, here in the swamp. <laughs> that's awesome. That's amazing. Oh, that's great. Yeah, you guys should, should take notes, right? <laughs> that's, that's good. Very, okay, yeah, let's go. All right. Oh. I've seen plenty of birds on this. I don't know what to This is where we're setting up camp. Oh, about damn time. Oh, thank God, my feet are killing me. Mm-hmm. Hi, guys, let's go, let's go ahead and get our tent set up. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna pitch my tent later with Eve. Huh? I'm, I'm telling you, if you don't get your tent set up and it gets dark, you're gonna be in bad shape. Yeah, but you only brought four tents, Kurt, and there's six of us. That's fine, we can share. Do you need a hand with that? I told you, 
I'm not a woodsy person. These tunes, they're so complicated. <sighs> uh, I, I, I remember, I remember when, when my dad used to take me camping. You know, we could just, we could just throw cord and sticks together and just make a simple lean to. <laughs> That's all we needed to survive, actually. It's funny. You, you, you throw so, so much random stuff just to throw it together and, and make something. It was, it's a whiz at that time. Well, he, he is a whiz. Still. Sounds like an interesting guy. Maybe. You, you'll meet him someday. Maybe. Uh, guys, we've got about an hour to lunch, so if we guys want to do some field research and um, take some notes, meet back here in about an hour, and then uh, we'll, we'll get some neat. Okay? I'll take care of this. It's not a big deal. I'll uh -huh. do it. Yeah. Thank you. Make sure you write stuff down. Oh, we will. <laughs> Great Dismal Swamp's over 200 kilometers long. And archaeologists suggest that there have been settlers here for like 13,000 years. And mostly Indians, probably. Until Europeans came over in the mid-1600s and then... <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm rambling. You know I'm not here for extra credit. I know. You do. I'm not either. But you're getting a C, aren't you getting a C? Some things are more important than my grade. Like what? I don't know. Do you remember that day in high school, or the, I think it was the, the 10th grade, where I, uh, I got my braces taken off? And I got to school after lunchtime, and I was walked around all day smiling at everyone, hoping that, that somebody would, would notice and, and say something. And then nobody did. Nobody said anything, not even my teachers. Until you. I mean, you noticed. Shelly. I like you. I mean, I like you more than just lab partners or more than just friends. I like you like with two people. Uh, that... Gary. I know. I like you too. You do? Why didn't you say something? I was waiting for you.
Guys? Uh, so, uh, how'd it go? Fine. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Great. Good. Did you guys get a good feel of the, the surroundings mm -hmm. and everything? Yeah. Good. Did anybody get hurt or anything? Uh-uh. Huh? Did you get hurt? No? I could have swore I heard somebody screaming. No, we, we definitely heard yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Eve thought she saw a snake out there. Oh, wait, she saw a snake? Well, did you get a good look at it? Yeah, it, it looked like a black snake, yeah. A, a, a black mamba. Black mamba? Yeah, a big one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Those things are, like, seriously dangerous. Should we move camp? It wasn't a black mamba. The mamba is an African snake. The only place you're going to see that is zoos and habitats. So, we don't need to move. We're fine. Could have been a cotton mouth. Um, they're pretty dangerous as well. Not, not, not as bad as a mamba, but be careful, guys. All I know is it was big and black. Yeah. Well, let, let's take a break. We'll get some lunch, and then uh, afterwards, I'll take you guys on a guided tour of the swamp. That'd, that'd be fun. That'd be, that'd be good. I have to pee. May I join you? Oh, yeah, sure. Have a seat. Or... <laughs> thanks. Hey, thanks again for the tent and for the whole lab thing. Oh, yeah. It's, it's no problem. I... I kind of... I kind of enjoy it, actually. <laughs> you eat? Not yet. Oh, here. Uh, uh, that's all right. <laughs> I make a mean turkey sandwich. No. Really, it's, it's all right. Okay, you caught me. It's from the deli, but they are to die for. Uh, it's not that. It's it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. Just I try I try to avoid eating meat. Are you vegetarian? Not really. Just okay. Well, when I was a kid, when I was a kid, I used to eat everything: bugs, worms, you name it. But now that I'm a, a little older, I try to. I try to be a little more conscious of what I eat. Yeah. And I'm studying to be a vet, so kind of defeats the purpose that you just turn around and, and eat them, you know, saving animals' lives and all. Good point. <laughs> <laughs> well, so uh, how long have you and your boyfriend been together? Oh, Brady? Just a few months. Is it? I know. It's a nasty habit, unattractive, causes cancer. I've heard it all before. Trust me. I only do it when I'm nervous. My boyfriend doesn't like it either. He's pissed that I came on this trip. Rather than some stupid party his friends were throwing. But my grade is more important than doing a few body shots with some frat guys. Right? Well, you are right about one thing. <laughs> that your grade is very important. So we're kind of we're running out of daylight. And uh, we need to get our research done. Okay, guys, let's uh, let's get to work. Um, get samples, photos. This place, this place is teeming with with life. So, it's, uh, you guys got plenty of information for your for your papers. So let's uh, yeah, and, uh, and, be, and be careful. There's there's a lot out there that can hurt you.
Kurt should have told us by now, gators are actually nesting creatures right up on the banks. They create families and they're very actually, aggressive. Actually, it's, it's extremely rare to see an actual alligator on the bank. But if you guys see one, just... Get it! Ah! Just relax. Just relax. Kurt! It's dead. What happened? A bigger gator ate it. That's what happened. We got to get off this goddamn bank. Alligator didn't do this. Poachers. I thought poachers sold their skins. Why would, why would they leave it here? Something must have scared them off. Like a bigger gator? Then who gutted it? That, that, well, that's a good question. Um, I'll, I'll call base camp, and we'll get them out here, and they can, they, they, they can look it over. Sure, our way the hell out here. Garrett. I'm Dale. Yes, ma'am. We got ourselves another damn poacher. Damn. Every time I turn around, I got another poacher running around this damn swamp. So what do we do? Nothing. You going about your trip. I'll send some guys out on patrol. It's about the best I can do. Unfortunately, most of them get away. Should we leave? I mean, is it safe if there's some guy with a gun shooting things out here? Well, honey, they want the gator, not you. You got a better chance of being eaten up by a bear out here than you do being hunted by some damn poacher. Oh, and that's supposed to make me feel a hundred times better. You stick together, especially at night. If you need anything, you call me on the radio. You're going to be fine. Hmm? I give you Dale's word on it. Thank you, Dale. Well, that's, uh, that's enough of an adventure for one day. Uh, let's, let's, let's head back. I'm not sure extra credit is worth this. I'm not even in this class. might be doing something a little else for some extra credit.
What? Can we go somewhere else? Why? This place is freaking me out. The trees are creepy. It's the same trees from this morning, baby. <laughs> no, it's like they're looking at me or something. You crazy girl. Hmm? Anyone hear that? Yeah. What was it? Uh, I don't, I'm not sure. They're gone. I think that was he. Maybe another black mamba? It's, it's cottonmouth, Gary. Whatever. The swamp is, is dangerous, guys. You shouldn't be out here at night to begin with. <sighs> OK, Gary. Yeah. Get your flashlight. We'll go look for him. Dana. I'm leaving the first aid kit. So if they come back before us, it's right here. Okay? And ladies, don't go anywhere. Okay? We'll be right back. Probably shouldn't have said that, huh? Be right back. Okay. You think something got him? What if it wasn't an animal? What was that supposed to mean? Well, what about poachers? Poachers? Yeah. You heard what that guy said. And they hardly ever catch him. And what, what, what if he wanted revenge or something? You're talking about murder, man. They're out here for alligators. They're not here to kill people. Well, either way. They're clearly not out here. Yeah. Let's head back to camp, check on the girls. Poacher was out there waiting for us. He had a club. He fucking bashed Kurt's face in. Listen, he's gonna be coming for us too. We need to get out of here now. Are you sure Kurt's dead? Yeah. Jamal and Eve probably are too. Look, I need to get us out of here. There's no service. I, I gotta try the radio. We, we, we don't have time for that. We can be here in a few minutes. the GPS. Our location is on this phone, okay? We can find the Jeep that way. Please, try and radio from there. Please, I have 
to try. Fine, hurry. Base camp, this is... This is... Team Extra Credit. Base camp, this is Team Extra Credit. Our group has been attacked and we need immediate help. Please respond. We don't have time for that, okay? We have to get out of here now. Come on. Serious trouble and need help. Over. Oh, where the hell are they? This is base camp. What is the nature of your emergency, Elmer? Our group has been attacked. Where's your team leader? He's been attacked too. Can you tell me the extent of his injuries? We believe. We believe they're dead. Our Jeep. Gary, where are we? I don't know. I don't know. I'll know right where you are. Stay put. Help's on the way.
is going on out here? Thank God you saved us. He was going to kill us. What? He, Calm down. No, 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 no. He was going to kill us. He had, he had Dana and he was going to kill her. Hey, tell me what happened. No, no. We, we, we need to either get the police here now or we need to get out of here. I'll check with the girl, make sure she's not injured. Okay. I'm fine. Uh, he... He dropped this. Yeah, he killed Kurt with that. With this? Yeah, <laughs> with that. Look at the blood on it. I don't think we'll be jumping to any conclusions. I mean, this blood could be even just about anything. I saw him bash Kurt's face in. Look, we'll be glad to answer all your questions, but right now, I want to get the f out of here. I don't like the way you're talking to me. See, clubs like this, they used to kill all kinds of things back here in the swamp. Sometimes we use them on rude people like you. Sometimes we use them to keep pretty little things from squirming while we have our way with them. We are gonna have our way with you. You got Dale's word on that. <laughs> what did Daddy tell you? Huh? Remember? We catch him. We don't kill him. Yeah, that's a good boy. think we are. We don't want to kill you. We kind of found of you, actually. I don't want you to think of this as the end. This is the beginning. Kind of like a first date. Only thing is, I don't know which one of you I want for myself. I know. So damn pretty, both of you. I've always been partial to blondes myself. <laughs> Why don't you get yourself ready? Because we're going to be fixing up a real nice dinner to get this date started. Guess what we're having, huh? You wanna know what we're having? Right there. 
This will be a date you'll never forget. <laughs> Shh, you got Dale's word on it. Okay, all right now. <laughs> Bye, baby. <laughs> oh, in case you think screaming will help, only people ever come close to finding this place are right there. Sunshine. Yeah. You just call it little thing, ain't you? I swear to God, some of y'all ain't got the meat enough to justify a fillet. Fortunately, your friends had a little bit more. Hey, darling. You sleep okay? Oh! Oh, my. This smells delicious. Delicious. Well, bone appetite, ladies. Dig in. Don't be bashful. Grateful. <laughs> Maybe in your college you can walk into any building and get your fancy foods and your gourmet coffees, but you don't know shit about the real world, Missy. <laughs> hey! Out here, you want sushi? You better catch you some fish. You don't want this? Fine, that's okay. That's <laughs> We're just going to go out and let you catch something you will eat. like what we got so you get to find you something better. Pick it up. Pick it up. Nice. You find it, you catch it. We'll cook it, okay? Right. Go on now, honey. Go on. Go on. Go on. You find us something good. Go on. Go on. Get my gun. She'll be much company. 
You got Dale's word on that. <laughs> Kind of takes all the fun out of gutting them and cleaning them. Bring her back. All of her. Big, 
Go to college, be a city boy. I got daddy's word on that. My boyfriend, I swear. When he finds you, he's gonna kill you. <laughs> Your boyfriend? <laughs> you mean this boyfriend? Oh, look at that there. Oh. Stop looking. Don't cry. Now I feel sorry for smashing his head in him. Oh, wait. I don't. Daddy. I'm gonna take care of this one all by myself. You be my guest. Yeah, special surprise for you. She's just a cabin! Sense. 
Get on in there and catch that kitty cat. You get your gun, check around back. Go on. like 20 times, baby. How did you find me? I'm just glad you're okay. Look. We gotta get the f*** out of here now. Dana. Dana. Hey, Chad. What Wait. the hell is that? Oh. oh. <laughs> Me and you now, Dana. <laughs> 